We're now outside at Colorado Golf Club on the driving range, beautiful facility. Bring it out here, you know, eventually to the course since that's what it's all about, right? Yeah, it doesn't do you any good just to hit a ball into a net. You need to hit it into those mountains out there. So understanding the motion measurements go a long way to making this easier. That's why we do what we do at Golf Tech that way. Okay, so you gave me a little bit of a lesson side. Now I'm yeah. gonna try and take this out here, see how it feels, see where we're starting with. Sure, so some more extension, some more tilting to the left. Nicely done. Okay. Expertly demonstrated. Yeah. Why don't you just do that? Yeah, exactly. That felt pretty good. Okay. okay. I've made this swing change. Yeah. Just ways that I can reinforce this when I'm practicing next. On the backswing, here's typically the pattern one more time that we see. Make a backswing halfway back or so, the shoulder tilt is too level to the ground, yeah. and the forward bend is too much. And that starts complicating how you're even going to hit the ground in the right spot. So a good way to practice if that is your problem would be to have a friend or hold up some obstacle that's an inch or two from your right ear, trail ear, and then you're going to try not to hit it with your face. So that's going to help me not stay for too long to yes. actually get some of this extension that we're looking for. Definitely. Going back to and that's, a bit. Uh, it's hard to find that stuff in books and DVDs. So this is the best way to practice it. If I'm extending more, but my shoulders are too level, do you have a drill to help with that? Yeah, absolutely. So you can take the club across your chest, lead shoulder has the grip side, and yeah. then make a backswing where all the way up to the top, you're trying to point the butt end of the club right about here, just almost where the golf ball's at. That'll tell you when you're getting close to that 36 degrees or maybe even a little bit more than that of the actual tilt of your shoulders. So that's more than I would tell you to do, but it's a good start for learning how to do it. Sometimes more. you need to exaggerate a little bit to, to really make that change That's in there. the point. That way you don't have to do this forever. You should be able to get better at golf quickly if you know what to do and your system is tidy enough. Okay, so I'm trying to keep my head from moving off it too much by imagining a shaft right here. Yeah, you got it. And then I'm also trying to feel like my left shoulder is more towards the ball to get that left side bend that we talked about. Correct. Okay. Tie those two together and you got a really tidy little backswing. That's the start of making the downswing and follow through much easier to do. Okay, and that, that felt pretty good. Maybe a little bit more into the ground than I like. So yeah. do you have anything to soften up the bottom a bit? Yeah, so if angle of attack's your problem, taking those divots that are really embarrassingly deep mm -hmm. or tearing the roots of the grass all the way out, go ahead and set up to this one. You can use the same sort of principle that we did for extending on this side of the ball. Mm -hmm but towards your lead ear, and then you're gonna to try to make that swing where you don't bash your eyeballs into this as well. If you do that, then you have to bend yourself backward as much as you need to to control the angle of attack and really shallow out the hit. Okay, so I'm gonna try and put all this together. You got it. I'm ready left shoulder. This right by your ear. Left shoulder at the ball. Head doesn't hit the back shaft in the back swing, and then head does not hit it on the fall through. Got it. Just barely tapped the tip of your cap, but if you weren't wearing a hat, that would have worked out great. And that, that, was nice. that hit was really shallow too. Awesome, those are some great tips. I appreciate it. I will work on that when I, <laughs> at some point. <laughs> exactly. But thanks for having me out. This has been a lot of fun. Love seeing the facility. It's great being out here. Beautiful yeah. facility out here as well. No problem. Thanks for the opportunity. I mean, we have 700 coaches and 700 people just helping other people in their community. That's yeah. what it's all about. Awesome, great stuff. Thank thanks. you, I appreciate it.